healthcare assistants are in great demand and the graduates have more than equal opportunity to get 100% employment once they've graduated. You get your certification, you're straight out of high school, you're going to be making a living wage. A healthcare assistant is an entry-level program and it's a very short program of 29 weeks and it focuses on the older adults so it really encourages students to get the experience of a college program and if they are interested branch into other programs because we have a number of healthcare related programs within the Health and Human Services. I took the healthcare assistant course. I heard about the course through my high school. It was a dual credit program. I felt like a superstar. <laughs> yeah, I felt awesome. And being done high school and college at the same time was such a relief and all my friends were just going into college. I was already working and I had a good job and at something right under your belt right away. I really liked it and enjoyed it. Well, I was interested in working in the healthcare field, but I didn't know if that was gonna be my career for sure. So seeing that this program was such a short term and that I could start it right away in high school, I decided it would be a good fit for me. Really hands-on learning and the difference between college and high school is you're actually doing something that you care about and it's specific to you. So it makes learning more in depth and something that you enjoy doing. So we have the MOA 155, which is medical terminology prerequisite course, and you can do that online. Or we have the MLAB 139 laboratory principles course, and that you can take as a precursor. It's a regular course in our program. So medical lab assistants are one of three courses in the allied health program at Camosun. So we have the medical lab assistant, which is accessible entries. We also have the medical radiography and the sonography program in allied health. One of the really great parts of Allied Health is the interactive labs and in our new building here we do have a teaching clinic on the first floor for the ultrasound students where they actually are working in an Island Health clinic. We have a course that's PNUR 101, which is Anatomy and Physiology. It's offered to students as a dual credit program. It's a prerequisite for the program, so students must complete this before entering into practical nursing. I would say do it. You don't have anything to lose because you're starting it before you even graduate high school, so you're not losing any time to this program. You're getting out into the, your career field right away. You get the experience right away. You're basically guaranteed a job because there's so many open positions. They're always looking for people in healthcare. Honestly, I'm feeling a lot better than, like I'm less nervous about university now because before I was like, hey, maybe it's gonna be super tough or, but now I kind of like know the general gist of it, so I'm pretty happy about that. I took PNUR 101, it was like the anatomy and physiology course that they provided at Camosa. So my end goal is to become an op optometrist, and I'm going to be attending UBC in the fall, and going into general sciences through that. I kind of prepped me for like how the course load is going to be, and like how I kind of present myself as I'm taking a course. And I think it was just a really valuable experience. 